Hello there, Madra Hill. Welcome back. It is Civilization VI. And what's happening right now is we are trying to see what we can attack and what we cannot attack. By that I mean we have a lot to attack and do. Very little... Well, we have no money. That's my problem. I have no money. I like money, typically. So I, I kind of wish I could have some more. I might build, like, a granary. No, we'll build an armory. It doesn't actually cost any money to have an armory. Um, we will now repair our granary. Hello. Hit them once. And then promote you. This unit is so good. Like, it's ridiculous how strong this unit is. I can't wait to burn it down. I love it. And once we're done with that, we'll just keep going. Like, look at this. They're just gonna keep they're just gonna rebel constantly. This is brilliant. Okay. Get this Liano in the way. We have a swordsman here. Everyone's just kind of getting a chance to to heal up a little bit, get their stuff together. You know, prepare the attack. Oh, there's the good stuff. Bang. And bang. And bang. Uh, and nope, that's a raise for me. Like, look at that, that's crazy. Cool, so we've done that. Um, there's a decent amount of things around here that we could consider. I mean, bread and circuses would make them shut up, but they, they're actually full loyalty to me. So, let's get an arena. And again, we're just, we're just moving on the way. We're just continuously pushing forward over here. Deciding a few things to build over here. Let's get a camp, uh, a library rather. Now have a bank, which is helping out with some of our cash. Let's get a commercial hub investment. Hello, bang. Again, I'm not a big fan of this city. I'm tempted to destroy it. Honestly, I am. I'll keep Valletta, definitely. Valletta seems like an okay city. That would be for each net adjacent tile. But that one's the best. Oh no, there. Perfect. Hey, right, stop that. My demands must be met. Buddy, I look forward to you trying it on. Oh, actually, he has a stronger military than me. He is actually noticeably stronger than me. That's interesting. So that has six. Yeah, look at that. 500 for each natural wonder tile here or adjacent. Oh, that's seven. So that's 3,500 science. Not all who oh. wonder are lost. Oh. Strategy requires oh. thought. I just got two techs in one thing. That's awesome. Yeah, Caracas over in Caracas again, University. About that bad boy. And we'll just move up here. And just start, you know, pummeling it to the ground. Really just kind of showing it who's boss. Uh me. I am the boss. I'm just gonna let these cities rebel, because they're gonna rebel in two turns. In three turns. I'm just going to let them do what they want, honestly. And bang. Oh yeah, we're just going to keep attacking. Left and right. Up and down. They can't... They don't seem to be able to do anything to me. And that's pretty interesting. Oh, there's like theological combat going on here. Oh, <gasps> they're under attack! Look at that! Damn! Someone's trying to jump ahead of me. There is little man has made That's not cool. Bro. That... That, uh, that natural wonder thing really is helping me out. Boop -ba -ba -doo. And a boo doo doo Ah, oh, I didn't take it! Lame. Oh, there we go. Boop. And, I mean, that'd be a great field city, but... Nope. You all died. 
Sorry. I'm sure you understand. And again, I'm just going to keep working on this, because... Although, actually, this is a beautiful city over here with all this culture, so never mind. We'll, we'll definitely allow that. We're going to market a bank and a walls. Ah, it's a rebellion. <laughs> the unique unit is just too good, bro. People can have the model to... It's just too excellent. Like, oh man, look, they're, they're here trying to steal this. And I'm just going to take it out from underneath them. Thanks. Uh, do I want this city? Industrial zone, a little bit of horses. Not, not really, no. It's like some iron, I guess, but ass. Yeah, I'm honestly not a gigantic fan of this city. Or should be there. I'd rather be like one to the side. <laughs> I'm coming for you, buddy. I'm coming. I'm just rocking up. Nobody can stop me, buddy. Let's go. Let's get a couple. Let's get a, a trader, and then you can get a university. Get me some more science. Um, let's change things up a little bit here. Let's let's go to Pokriva. Yeah, let's let's build some roads. Oh my god. Hello. Oi. I'm just laying waste to these people, aren't I? Boop doop doo. Turn. And again, just gonna keep moving. There's nothing they can do. Yeah, there, there's no peace for you, buddy. Look, those two other cities have rebelled. That's awesome. Ooh, claim a great person, a great merchant, grants a toys. Ooh, four amenities, lovely. Um, I'm still, I'm tempted to get a military engineer to try and get some rows together. Over here, I want a bank. Ah, oh, this is awesome. This is just ridiculous. Two production for that. Now let's get one of these because that gives me two production for factory buildings. My god, Gilgamesh has just grabbed everything, isn't he? Been a real douche. Hey. Okay. Get over here towards Veleta. Oh, hello. What have we here? Ooh. Set in. So, this means I can actually get to hit. Oh, is that actual core? Nice. Oh, no, it belongs to the Congo. It belongs to the Congo. Sorry. My bad. I thought you were them. I think this is basically their last city. And there we go. I will actually keep this city. It looks fun and filled with culture and joy. Who doesn't love culture and joy? I do. Boom, amenities. Hit that bad boy. I'm just on a rampage, aren't I? This is ridiculous. Open borders. Sorry, my lovely friend, but no. No. Okay. We're just gonna kind of just keep hitting people right in the face. Precisely where it hurts. Do -do -do. Okay. God, look how far that guy can go. Give a lovely little promotion bonus. Again here. Look at these rebellious cities. Okay. What else? What else? A library and a university, please. Thank you very much. You guys can heal one more turn. I think we should just wait a little bit. 
Oh, formation units all inherit escorts movement speed. It's actually not that great. Culture and joy are corrupting our youth. This is precisely true. And yet we're still culture filled and wonderful. We're just so great. Buddy, we're just so good. The alert. Heal up. And over here, I think we should try and do a... I mean, really, I'd prefer the one that gives me the most gold. Tell you what, skip your turn, because I, I could put you in Valletta. Ooh, that crossbowman almost died. Congo's denounced me. Yeah, unsurprising. Not sure I care, buddy. Not sure I care. The key words of violent ah, cool. are urbanization, industrialization, nice. centralization. Okay, how many coal do we have? One tile. Where? Oh, well, on their holy site. That's a bit weird, but okay. And the other one up here. So we get six coal per turn. Weirdly, no coal in our homeland. Really? No coal at all. That surprises me greatly. Seriously, no coal anywhere? Not even, like, just outside our borders? Tons of niter. Look at that. As far as I can tell, there's, like, no coal, no coal anywhere. Thank God I attacked, and thank God I wasn't waiting for coal to attack places. Otherwise, I'd have been screwed. Jesus. All right, let's, uh, let's get railroads. Oh, yeah. Two shipyards. Eh. And sanitation as well with the step levels and the medics. Always good. Economics with stock exchange. I mean, getting oil, I think, would be pretty good. But so would getting steam power. These are all things I want. Oh, yeah. Um, forgot to take this city. Uh, the last city. Them. And a boop. Nice. Oh, uh, whoops. Yeah. And finally, shebang. Bye bye, Scythia. The Empress falls, but I will be remembered, will you? Well, yeah, obviously, because I've conquered you. Scythia will not stand the test of time. So, this is actually a city state interesting and it has maize and rice and tea and little else um i will keep it as a road connection basically i think it's a fine one let's build that and some walls and we'll there be good so let's get a road to veleta actually let's connect to veleta itself I can't believe how little coal we have in our or in our areas. Away. The armies of jealous civilians failed to stop our people. The military emergency resolves in reclamation and blame. I didn't even know there was one. I didn't Oh yeah, I was being attacked, wasn't I? That was like the whole point of what I was doing. I just kind of I just kind of ignored it. I honestly just ignored it. Because I'm so awesome. I'm just too cool. Pretty tight. God, you only get what, two build charges. That is such bullcrap. Uh, Nagadara gives me two faith. A little bit of that. Ooh, there is a dam here. The dam right there so we can stop the freaking flooding everywhere. Great. Go on. Put a road there. And we're going to relocate to Valletta as well. Pretty good. Yeah, this looks good. This looks good. Then we're just going to fortify everybody else because we're no longer at war with anybody. Which is good. <laughs> also bad because I'd like to be at war with people. Uh, it's fun. Let's connect. I mean, we do actually already have roads to all of this. But let's connect roads to Mabamba, because I think that's where the capital is. So there are already roads there, but there are not roads to Mazamba. So let's go to Mazamba, Nasudi. Great. 
That'll, that'll get me where I need to go. Great. Beautiful. Okay. And let's say with the will of the real flourishing industrial culture began with the discovery of nationalism. Oh, yes. Now we can make cores. Okay. Towards industrial era melee anti cavalry and range units have lifted the from being injured. Yes, because I have enough units now. And I can make cores now. I like this. And this. I'm still quite poor, though. I've been neutralized. That's the main irritation that I've been rather irritated. Hey, it completes the advisors. I think we're pretty on track for a golden age right now. Mercenaries. In Shindoku, let's do a factory and a coal power plant. And over here, we will go with a road connection to Bogata. Perfect. I imagine there will be some oil up there sooner or later. I'm gonna heal up here. What map type is this? I believe I did a Pangea map because I just wanted to uh, just conquer everybody and mess people up. Very low on money is my problem. Welcome to the stream, by the way, buddy. We are now making more money, thankfully, but it'd be better. They say prayers, bread and circuses. I really want any of this. Build a wall. Actually, wait. Can he upgrade? Nope, just don't have enough gold. Life is pain. Now, I don't want to core these Liernos because they get adjacency bonuses. So, no. No, thank you. I have to wait until I have some gold now to be able to upgrade my cores. Peace. One is despoiled by and there is our 50% discount of unit upgrades. Oh, yeah. That's the stuff. Now, what do we... I want to depend on donation game how locked in you can get. Yes, bad mount placement can absolutely screw you, but it is very funny. It's very funny if it happens. So mobilization would allow you to get, me to get armies, which is always fun. Urbanization for neighborhoods is pretty good. Urbanization is not a terrible way to go, honestly. Ah, let's just go mobilization script. Oh, a great engineer. The computer's technology. Let's just build one more district in the population limit. Oh, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Give me a bunch of things. Hey, yeah, stay there. Oh, can my knight now upgrade? Can! Alright, come over here. Uh, yeah, you can build that. Oh, computers. Lovely. Just gonna wait a little while, wait for all the cash to kick in. Lovely, lovely cash. And in Bogata, we're gonna do a factory. We're not going to do a power plant because I should be able to upgrade it by then. And a commercial hub. And here in Kyoto, we have got an armory completed. We will build another builder because there's still a lot of work to be done. Over here, we will get... Knowing they built a freaking aqueduct, they really didn't need it. We'll get a granary. Actually, no, we really need a builder. Hello, thank you so much for the follow, buddy. Welcome to the stream. I really don't know why that is so loud. Like, that's ungodly loud. Dear Christ. Make sure you check out my YouTube channel if you haven't done so already, by the way. And, yeah. Build the granary, why not? Ah, we can upgrade this guy to a field cannon. Beautiful. All my cash, but that's fine. Couple of these, all what you need. It felt really loud to me. It, like, deafened me. Okay. No, bro, I'm not going to give you demands. I have a bigger... Oh, actually, he has a bigger army than me. Bolt actions speak louder than words. Ooh, you know what? He actually is ahead of me in tech. He's got two techs more than me. 
It's not 100% okay. Just focus on developing some science, shall we? It looks like that is going to actually become one of my cities for Freezies, which is great. Thank goodness I just let them do that. <gasps> Wait, what? What? From the dust to which our civilization first rose, so too shall we return. What? I lost? As the light of our people fades to nothingness. Excuse me? I wonder if one will rise to rekindle. I just lost. I just lost. I lost to a religious victory. I lost to a religious victory. Ugh. I honestly forgot. I usually turn off religious victory because it's just so boring. Oh, build a missionary. They fight. Build a guru. They fight. There's no unique things. It's just like the same crap. Oh, I wasn't looking at it this whole game. And because now they're like the only other sieve. Besides crappy Congo, I've been destroyed. I've been destroyed. That's it. I'm dead. I am dead. That sucks, bro. Oh my god, I lost. I was winning. I was winning. Oh my god. That sucks. <laughs> Fair play. To be honest, I usually I usually turn off religious video. I guess I just forgot. Oh my God, what an end of the series, though. What an end. Yeah, look at that. Oh, catastrophic eruption. Yeah, man, you got me. Ah, oh, man, that sucks. I would have gone in with about ten turns, taken over the Congo, and then I'd have been on them like bacon, man. On them like bacon. What the hell am I saying? You know what I mean. I'd have messed them up. I don't even know where their capital is, but ah, oh, that's so sad. Well, that's it. I've I'm I lost. I don't care. I don't care how it is. I lost the game, bro. Um. So yeah. In in conclusion, Simon Bolivar, fantastic sieve to play. If you want to maybe uh try out some good stuff, you want to do some good things. Really good sieve. Really excellent Renaissance era and industrial era conquest victories. And just great for conquest victories in general because you could promote and then still move. So you can take damage, promote your unit, and then attack with them. And there's a huge swing there. Very powerful unit. Hacienda is pretty good, but I didn't really get a chance to utilize it because it's a unique improvement that comes a bit too late. You're already really established, and by the time you get it, you're already invading things. But that's it. Thank you so much for watching, guys. It's been a fun series. If you'd like to see me do more Civilization stuff on this channel, you have only to ask. Um, thank you so very much for being here. I was Alger Hill, and I will continue to be, and that's the end of the series. Please let me know if you want to see more Civ stuff, and see you next time. Bye-bye.